Let's lift our hands to Jesus up. Father, we thank you. We give you praise for this moment. We thank you that you are a living God. And what makes you living is because you speak. Sanctify this moment. Speak to us, O oh God. This is my prayer. That your word will be so simple that the simplest of us will understand. Yet that it shall have so much power that the simplest of us will become uncommon. And they will wonder what happened. And we will say it's because you spoke. Thank you for mantles in the house. I pray that you will take us to the next level. In Jesus' name. And somebody shout. Amen. Before you sit, find three, four people and tell them, my friend. I know you think you know me. But from this week, you will not be able to recognize me. So look at me very well. Aha, let's do it in Nigerian accent. My friend, look at me very well. Because after today, you will never understand me again. In Jesus' name. We will do that one in Indian accent. Say, my friend, look at me very well. Because after today, you are not recognizing me again. Put your hands together for Jesus. Amen and amen and amen. Let's have our seats. As, hey, 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 hey. Don't hey. sit like usual. You are now a different person. Sit like a new person. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes, 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 yes. Wow, what a joy to be here. I'm excited to be here. Uh, how many of you have seen me and know me somehow? And the rest of you? Are you planning to go to heaven? <laughs> yes. I'll ask you, are you from Uganda? Yes. Do you know this man? No. Wait. Next. <laughs> but I thank God that from today, you will enter heaven quickly. <laughs> Amen. So I'm excited to be here. Are you ready? Are you ready? I've been in the ministry for a very long time. Uh, this coming month on 21st, I'll make 35 years in salvation. And then, by this year, I've made 30 years as a pastor. I started in ministry as a watchman in the church. <laughs> That's better. So, um, it, it is very interesting when you stay in something for long. With the time, sometimes you begin looking at it and you wonder, is this thing working? Hello? Am I talking? Those of you who are here and you are married, when you loved that person, you didn't know you become disappointed with them when you get married. Hello? Come on, am I talking? Hello, hello, are you following me? So, I, I learned after some time that it is possible to be in something and grow old in it when you even don't know it. Mm. Again, I saw pastor moving, so let me move some more. Amen. Amen. And he may refuse me to come back. And yet, I want to come when we are dedicating the cathedral that will come from this way up to there. Uh, because nobody will be in this church and cannot drive a car. So we need parking. I think we will even have to think of underground parking. 
and you are looking at me like this. I'm telling you it's going to happen. You cannot have a crazy man like this and then you do common things. Praise Praise the Lord. Lord. I'm also a crazy man. I think slightly crazy than most people. Hallelujah. 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 Are you following me, good people? I want to begin from where the man of God left off. Something called that man to think. When I just given my life to Christ, I went for a conference. In Lugogo Indoor Stadium. Reason why I came. Because they told me there is a man who raises the dead. And they said he came from Nigeria. I said, ah, I need to come and see this man again. So I came. First of all, the pomp with which this man came. He said, Praise God. Then he said, Amen. He said, ah, Amina. Uganda people, what's wrong Uganda? with you? Is that how you shout Amen? He said, ah. Okay. I am going to say a few things today. And I will preach tomorrow. When I look at you, Nobody is ready to carry what I brought. I said, okay. <laughs> you are just look at us and we cannot carry. What have you brought, my friend? What is going on? <laughs> he said, they have told me how are Uganda people, you are too soft. This God you are dealing with is a very stubborn man. He shall tell you to seek him. Then he hide. This man is very old though. Before the war has started, he was there. Hey. I'm really enjoying the guy. <laughs> are you following me, good people? Then he said, I will teach you only one truth and I will go away. He says, if you are not careful, you will never get anything from God. I want to teach you something, one, one thing like this. It will change your life forever. And it's not for everybody. I am in. Uh-huh. So the man said, You know, God has made a big mistake. Huh? You, <laughs> look at this man. God makes a mistake. See, I can take him anywhere I want. You know why? Because God has made a mistake. He make his house in my heart. The way that guy hit his chest. I thought he was going to break. He said, God has said. If I accept he come in my life. You be inside. When I go to toilet, he must come with you. Hey, that made me say, huh? <laughs> what? And from that day, I took on a mantle. I can take God anywhere. And because of that, I can do anything. Thing. If God has ever done it, I will do it. If on Jesus said, I will do even greater than what he has done. I don't know many people who have done what I do. And yet I'm just starting. I want to do some serious things in this country. So that everybody will know my name. 
and, 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 and the reason why they will know my name is because, because of my relationship with God. Are you following me? That's what I want. If it's the only thing I'll do and I die, that's what I want to do. As a watchman in KPC, they started churches. And then they told us to pray for God to raise young people to go and pastor those churches. Me, myself, and as I know myself, I cannot be a pastor. Because if you disturb me, I will use Psalm 23. I will get a staff and a rod and I will comfort you. And you don't blame me. Is where Jesus got me from. When Jesus saved me, I had a group called BBC. And it was in full, it's called Bad Boys Company. We were bad. As in bad. Have you understood that? We were very, very, very bad. Now the problem is that God also gave me strength. Because if you are small, even if you are bad, you are not that. Amen. Amen. Don't I look like I have some strength? Hey. <laughs> so you make me a pastor. Eh? You make me a pastor. Then some stupid sheep brings cavio. <laughs> so me, I don't want to be a pastor. So I went to pray because our pastor says you pray. I was in the upper room at KPC. Actually, the ministry of upper room started in KPC, but I don't know why you, you got yours from the Bible, I think. So, I was there praying, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Oh God, pick young people here, oh God. Take them, oh God. Take them to Karamuja. Take them, you know, I was sending them to all those difficult places. And when I'm praying and sending other people, God said, you are one of them. I don't want to go to Karamoja. Hey God, was that you? <laughs> That's where my prayer ended. Because, okay, so me a pastor. First of all, me a pastor. How? Uh, uh. The man said, following up people. You gave your life to Christ. Then I follow you to continue following Christ. Nonsense. <laughs> Are you saved for me? Me to become a pastor. I don't think so. But anyway, God said, and can you imagine of all towns in Uganda? It takes me to Masaka. I used to cast out demons. Where do you come from, Masaka? Uh -uh. <laughs> so I, that's the last place, first of all, I want to go because there are many demons there. But also, I had big plans. By, by the time God tells me to come to Masaka, I had a Canadian fiancé. And, and, and uh, they had gotten me a job, they had gotten me a house, and had gotten me, a and had gotten me sponsorship to study until I stopped. And at the same time, 
Mr. Mayanja Nkanji was a member of our church. He was Mr. the minister of, of uh, finance in Uganda here. Mr. He came to the church and said, please give me the most trusted person you have. We want somebody to go and lead a department, a sensitive department at the airport. And and all of them, because I had been such an amazing watchman, they gave me the, the, the opportunity. Wow. Wow. Then another Muzung, same same week, came and said, I want you to take you to Bible school. Canada. Bible Canada. School. Bible school. Airport. I'll take airport. Anytime. This is ready money. I'm telling you. And at that I was 20 something, young man, 20. Or 24. I saw myself in six years. I said, Father God, where should I go first? Masaka. Masaka. I said, it's not on the list. Masaka mukama. I don't know about you. It's not on. Number two. Do what in Masaka? Me. God, please forget about this thing. And, and by the way, until that time, I was very near to my BBC. Very near. When I was working as a watchman at church, you know KPC, Watoto is near Seka Market. So those guys used to come like those things, we need to get security. They used to come. And they, they started by removing side mirrors. They open and remove radios. Then they graduated. You, they will come and pick motorbikes, bicycles. Motorbikes. Okay. One time we were there, all of us. All of us. We were, we were watching a new double cabin came, stopped there. Men jumped off. They picked a new motorcycle, they put on the double cabin. And they drew. And the service ends, the man said, Where's my, my motorcycle? He said they took it. What was the number plate? Eh, number yeke yeha. Ayah. That thing annoyed me. Then one day we come out of church. And we find a man's car sitting on stones, all the tires taken. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was angry. Now, then people said, these people must be working with the watchmen. They were working with the watchmen. How can I do that when the watchman is here? I, yeah, yeah, I got then I pray the prayer. That time they were teaching us about the fruit of the Spirit. It was the gift of the Holy Spirit, I think. They said God can give you a gift of discernment. So I prayed for it as a Father God. I am a watchman. I want a gift to separate thieves from the good people. Guess what? God gave it to me. Up to today I have it. Like as we are seated here, if there is anybody who has come to steal, I will just sit there and ask you. Hey, I don't, please, I don't even pray about it. I don't, it's just like either somebody will expand and reduce or there will be something around it. So, God gave me that thing. That same day. So, I'm sitting there and I see a young man came and he came tall and short. 
So I, I said, did you see that? I said, what? That boy became tall and short. So they followed him. Then I saw a girl, very beautiful girl. She became big and small. Yeah. Come here, follow that one. Then there was another guy who came and I saw like, like folk following him. He was a bit big, so I followed this one myself. When people were lifting up hands, I saw him looking around. He first put up his hand, then he put like this, then he started touching people's bags. I waited. He picked something. He put it in the pocket. He picked in this one also. He put it in the pocket. I wanted to get him. I said, let me wait. Because I knew he was a bit big. I didn't want people to get hurt. I am saved. I am spirit filled. When I enter a room and they are casting out demons, they come out before I begin. Very saved. But I didn't know that something had not yet changed. So, I followed the guy. Then he, gave, he gave one of his friends to take one of the things. So I told my guys, follow me. So we followed them. As soon as we get out of church, I grab him. Where the things were moved from the back. Say, which one? Then you, hey. 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 Banged him in the wall. I said, no, Where no, are the no, 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 of course, they brought the other guys. Uh, where's the thing they gave you? Uh, on the wall and back. Hey. Came them nicely. <laughs> Took them to the police. And they came back. They have reduced, they have left us. Said, ah. They left you. Okay. Okay. Next Sunday, again, this, then now the spirit is working. We, we took others. They also came out. And they come back and say, hey, if you have to touch the man, and Sunday to come out. So I told uh, the deacons, I said, guys, you have to come out. Please allow us. We are going to do physical counseling. We to Because the Bible says, we are going to do physical counseling. Because the Bible says, Foolishness is tied up in the child. But the rod of correction will remove it. I had to do this in the spirit, my friends. <laughs> they said, yeah, I think you are right. You are right. I said, thank you, sir. The next Sunday, this young man, he was not very tall, but I saw him tall. He became short and I said, ah, I said, I became short and said, ah, Got this one. Took him to the room. He said, My friend, you have to decide. We are going to cane you. But you decide how many. If you say few, I multiply by five. If you see many, I cane you. He says, I want, oh, no, I'm going to get saved. I say, ah, yeah, of course, of course, you must get saved. But after, I can you. <laughs> I'm just giving you a bit of example that people have come from somewhere. I follow you. And so, I got another guy. He said, you can him for me. This guy was bad, bad. We told him if you cry, you rub, you touch, you rub. <laughs> Gave him three. He screamed. They say you have rubbed. Gave him four. He touched. Gave so him. he decided to scream. And he screamed so loud. Yes, please. What's going on there? Pastor Gary. Yeah. 
Say, Pastor, we are doing physical counseling. What do you mean physical counseling? Uh, we are disciplining a brother. Say, so open the door. I said, Daddy, it's not nice. Please. My work here, so I opened. So I said, My work here is to be a watchman. Your work is to be our senior pastor. Go do your work, sir. I'm doing my work. Now, this man I'm talking to is a white man, but he's not just a senior pastor, he's a white man. He said, he pushed his glasses up. Are you trying to stop me from entering a room in this church? I am I'm not trying, trying, but I'm just saying it's not good for now. So, are you saying I will not enter? You should not be nice, so I will not let you enter. Sir. Because if you enter these guys, this is supposed to send a sign that when you go to steal in that place you will not want to go back again open the door I say pastor you are not entering so we went back he he kicked the door I put my leg this is my senior pastor and his white he went, call me the chairman of the board. <laughs> he cannot be here. He cannot be so, when those guys came, say, sir, we, we are the ones who told him to do it. But he will kill somebody, say, no, he cannot. He's just caning. He's doing it. Okay, so now when that guy saw I chased a white man, he laid down, said, me. <laughs> they gave him four, it was too much, he screamed again. So I grabbed him. I was a <laughs> please. So I put him back. <laughs> so they caned his five and were over. I say, say thank you. Yeah, say, thank thank you. you. I say, okay. You wanted to get saved? No, you have beaten me. Say, my friend, you want to get saved? Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Repeat this prayer after me. <laughs> <Father God. laughs> I led him to Christ. I met him later, I think five or fifteen years later, he's now a pastor. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Am I talking to people? Now, that's the guy I'm talking about. How do you make such a guy a pastor? How do you make a person like that a pastor? If you are the senior pastor, would you send that boy to go and be a pastor? I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Not at all. You disrespect me. You want to beat me. I make you a pastor. Then you can do this. Okay. Okay. So now after that day. I am now very charged. I have the backing of my pastors. Next Sunday. There were five guys seated there. And I saw a big fog around them. I told all the security people. Today these are the only ones we are dealing with. Myself, I'm not even going to the toilet. There was a man who had the jacket. I don't see the jacket. Ah, and then I saw the sleeve of the jacket. Like he removed, but I saw his sleeve and somebody else had sat. Then I remember he had the checked so checked. And I see the guy on the bicycles. I heard something. He broke the, 
they look ah, everything i did not know was still inside rose up i <laughs> went for the guy grabbed him like this the shot got torn and remained with a piece I mean, I was, he's standing in the wall his friends came to help him uh, this was even easier now <laughs> got another one bang them in the wall grabbed another one so when the other two saw me banging this one they took off grabbed i don't know how the other two got i got this one then the other two i don't know how i got the two of them in one hand very born again spirit filled ndiyo munta zwirobwa kavera kana nyuzwire na no moyo bazat work konga ndya hamurumo base bona banyabo so i take them in the room we had an, a room there naba twa room chenge twatwide chenge chi to the other two na janta bar bar mujede mbachire so i stayed there with another short asha now, stupid guys. One of them said, Omoyajira, to be kuve to gende. Deka to be tere to gende. Aye. If I was saved, I forgot I was saved. Hatun kavanzu ndo na yuko kujambu zuruki. I'd not even beaten them well. Tinda ba tere na gende. Aye, aye, aye. So I told the other guy, let's go. Na janta deka to gende. So when I did like this, they thought I was running. I turned and came back. Let's go. The other stupid one again followed. On the wall. The other guy was scared. Long story short. I beat those people. I'm saved. Speak in tongues and interpret them. There are two types of mantle. The one he was talking about and the one you had before. You can be born again but you carry mantle. You can be born again but you carry mantle. For me I'm a mchiga. Uh, that's some people I'm talking to. Am I talking to anybody here? He no one yoni ngamba na we. When we are here, mazima yetso nyemeronje. Eh, Jesus is so good. Turuk him sa turuk chumba terra turuk zina. Until we go to the market. Baka tu chiromu katari. And the boda boda man doesn't give you all your change. Hatom shwa boda boda abra kuga rabaransi na we. No yena. You will you. <laughs> Fights for me. And then the neighbors go to eat your. And then you go and fight this battle. You people, you will not just hey. You think if I'm born again, I'm a fool? Am I talking to people at all? You people, I beat up men. I hit them down. I hit them on the on floor. Top. And I hit them with my elbows. Ah, you want to beat me? They can't take him. They can't take him. And I'm still saved. Speaking tongues. The one who said he beat us, I kicked him in the mouth. Broke his teeth. Broke his teeth. I gave him a tooth he had broken. By the time the police came, they cannot stand. They just fall. Bagwa. Next Sunday, Sunday Sereho, we go for hospital ministry. Hallelujah. 
And I am leading the team. Kandi ninye na yebembire chivine cho. How many of you see where I'm going with this? Mbanga habaru kurebe yindu kutora. Mlago 4A. Tuaza mlago 4A. Casualty. Iba casualty. Ay, ay, ay. Abantabi bironda. And I saw a shirt, pink shirt, a checked shirt. Na ribe sati ya checked ya pink. I've seen that shirt before. Ayat, ay, esate jo kanda jire ibiriho. And there are three men. Na ribe sati ya checked ya pink. Faces you can't recognize. And they are being fed through those tubes. Because they had broken teeth. Okay, I, I'm not excited when I say this. But I'm saying you can be saved. How have you saved things when something has not changed? So, of course, Hati, I had to leave that place quickly. So I told you, hey guys, I need to go back. Take over. But as I'm leaving and I'm thinking, if they attack me, I'll throw them off. I mean, I'm leaving. Went back to KPC. Fell on the altar, started crying, Father. <laughs> I must kill your people. Change me, O God. Come on, Pindura. Remove the heart of stone. You know what Balokole we do, eh? Praying, crying. And as I'm praying, I get a scripture. Second Timothy chapter 2 verse 19. So I looked for my Bible. And I'm opening. And I read it says. But God's truth stands firm. Give me, give me New King James. Better than New King James. So nevertheless, the solid foundation of God stands firm. Having this seal, the Lord knows those who are His. So I thought God is saying, I'm not His. Oh, forgive me, Lord. Give me another chance, O oh God, and I'm crying. And the Bible says, He knows those who are His, and let everyone who names the name of Christ depart from iniquity. <laughs> Remove iniquity from me. I ah. went to the verse 20. I was reading and I'm crying. Uh -huh. Help me read together, those of you who can read English. One, two, three, we go. But in a large house, there are not only vessels of gold and silver, but also of wood and clay. Some for honor and some for dishonor. Ah, yeah. Oh, God, I want to be of honor. You know, I'm. I'm reading, God is speaking to me, but I know he has rejected me. Give me the next verse. The next verse shocked me. Let's read together. One, two, three. Therefore, mm. I say, mm. Wait. Yeah, if you clap, clap, don't threaten me, my friend. What was my prayer? Change me. What was my prayer? Remove this heart. What is God saying? If any man cleans himself, how can I clean myself? Because I'm the one who dirted myself. That's why the man says, I've left them. Hey. If any man, thank you. That means not special people. Any man. If he can do it, he can do it. He can do it. But, but you people, do you know how hard it is for a doctor? Eh? To begin praying for the sick. You must be sick to do that. 
I'm telling you, and if you are not careful, they can revoke your certificate. Because as medical people, we know how people fall sick. We know that when you have malaria, you have malaria parasites. So when you pray, what happens to the parasites? Smartness. And that's why many people they can be in a church like this. But they have natural minds. I like what the man of God said. He says, My wife believes in that man. The wife said, We can do it. And we went. Which means the man himself. No, he struggles with it. And, and he's right. For, as a man, you have to think. You can't just go like a foolish man. Begin a church. Where are we going to get the money? Who is going to support us? Where are we going to get members? And then he's the one supposed to be a pastor. The one who is saying is just going to be a pastor's wife. But God is funny. He shows this one. Because of that one. That we can do it. I don't know if I'm communicating to people. So God says, if anyone, in other words, God will say, stop crying. Cleanse yourself. I don't like how you are. Work on yourself, my friend. Hey, but how? And then God says, once the man cleanses himself, then God will now make that person a vessel of honor. Once the person decides I'm changing, then God begins to sanctify. God will never force you until you are ready. Until you are ready. I tell people that I've been married for 26 years to my wife. And I tell them, in those 36 years, I've never quarreled with her. Is that possible? If a man, and I tell people, I have never even, not once, raised my voice to my wife. Do you think I know how to raise my voice? Hey! If I shout for you, my friend. And do you think I can beat my wife? Thank you. Whom can I trust? Yeah, you try to squeeze this up here. Yes. You matter who hurry. This one is scared, Wama. What a who hurry in Kokote. And I'm going towards 60. Kandi in Yoni Dumbankaga. If you had seen me before, Hatamuntaya and David Yogan Maho. Six packs. I mean, why don't I do it? Why don't I do it? Why don't I do it? But, but not only Kuvireka, and it's not only living there. I know who I am. Ni manya ni chechindi. The Bible says, "Bible nejira." Once you become. In Christ Jesus. What happens to you? The earth is gone. Behold, the new has come. So, God will not come and remove your old. Uh -uh, you just know this is old. 
Hatiyo and you leave it. Yeah. Ego. Am I joking? One time, thank you for the word for the mantle. I was my Bible. And the scripture says, life and death are in the power. Number two, another scripture came. It says, and God said, let there be. So I got the revelation to create a new me. So in my house, when I go to a mirror, a black man comes. So I say, hey, you. So yes, sir. Where are you going? No, I'm going for minutes out. I'm going to allow you on one condition. You are only allowed to be sweet and nice. Sweet and nice. Sweet and nice. If I find you not sweet and nice, I will kill you. Yeah. 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 This is my daughter. She only knows sweet and nice. Even when she becomes stubborn, she knows. No, we are just all quite about that. You are the only person I can tell all I want. That no even your mother knows what she wants. She wants. Kunga mbara pione biaro kuenda. I say, have you done good? You are still my girl. Njante, uchulu mhara wanje. When those days when she was sick, he would call me. Have you talked to your daughter? Obi abi na kui ra kachira kum. Please talk to her. <laughs> I don't know what you have said. I have a better wife than the one I had before you talked to her. <laughs> Am I talking to people? Yes. Uh -uh. Yes. But I'm in Christ Jesus. Yes. 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 And because I'm in Christ Jesus, there's a prayer I pray every morning. Lead me not into temptation. Because if you cross a certain line, I don't know what I might do. Yeah. Because being a bishop does not take away my knowledge of punching. Karate commando Swazineka. Am I talking to people? Uh -huh. And I learned also when I get back home. As soon as I enter my gate, I'm a boyfriend. Boyfriend. So at home, my wife doesn't know bishop, doesn't know pastor, doesn't know senior pastor, knows boyfriend. Boyfriend, boyfriend. Hey, baby, what's up, man? Boyfriend, wange kavite, mukundo wange. Because I realized that if I'm if I become a husband, she will become an old woman. So if I'm a boyfriend, what is she? Abo kubanka manyangu na abo mshisha na wena azaku wa mchara akure kumkati tukio akasigazikatona no mchibuto. I call her baby. Ni mweta umwerere. Then I treat her as kandu mwerebe ranko mwerere. I can, my wife cannot pay ni doa wena mara. Hey mama wait. Hey you pay for it. But, but let me tell you something. This is not me before. I think I'm talking to people. So give me our, our theme scriptures I summarize. But I'm sure somebody has been blessed today. Let's go to Romans 12. Let's pick it from verse 1. Let's do verse 2 and then we go to verse 1. So let's go. 1 through 3 we go. And do not be conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind, 
that you may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. What does that mean? What makes you a Christian is not to confess Christianity. But to have a Christian mind. That's what the Bible says. This mind should be in you which was also in Christ Jesus. What made Christ the Christ we know was not because he was a child of God and because of the mind he had. Mm. Can I tell you something? For a very long time I thought I was a child of God until I read the scripture. The scripture says he came to his own John 1 but his own received him not John 1 11 huh? give it to us he came to his own and his own did not receive him huh? verse 12 but as how many as many as received him. To them he gave Harass. The father, the father harassed which one? Hati The first one. You know why? Because their father had told them that when you come of age, I'll give you your things. Hello, talk to me. Come on, talk to me. Of the two. Who reached the age first? Hati Ombarviri, Ayachusoki, the Pemiak of Funebin to Noha. Bantu Mugambenanye. Can you talk to me, you people? Who got there first? No, I am the Funemaka, the old one. Omkuru, his birthday came. Okwasa, he just the young one on his birthday. Hatuomoto Hamasa, he says, Daddy, Akajatata, you are the best daddy. I am of age. Give me my things. Did the father refuse? No. Why? Because the son had grown. He asked for what belongs to him. The Bible says the father divided in the middle. And the young one was given his. The old one kept the balance. You know the story. The young one went and wasted. The Bible says. Things became so bad. Until he had to feed the, pig, the pigs. And he started eating of the food of the pigs. I like that boy. He says, I'm not going to die when pigs are getting fat on the food. I like that boy. You cannot continue living like you have when you don't have. Hello? Hello? 
I remember when I married my wife, she was getting 12 times my salary, uh, six times. I started praying, Father. I am the head. I need money to lead this family. Father, make a way, make a way. Open up a door, open up a door. I call money from America. I call money from Britain. I call money from everywhere. Yeah. My wife came and said, Thank you for praying. Said, yeah, 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 yeah. What has happened? They have doubled the salary. I first said, Yes! Every month, she gets my whole year's salary. Now, which kind of aid is that? <laughs> One time, when I'm at home, I, I like to lie down in the sofa and I put my legs up. It just relaxes me. So my wife came and said, Hey, you are stretching. Because these were her chairs. I sat down and said, Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you are following me. In my mind, if you have not bought it, you cannot stretch in it. I don't know. If we are talking about the mind. So, one day I was praying as a father. I don't understand this. Whole. And God said, he gave me a scripture. The one who wants to be great should be servant of all. What was God saying? It's not about money. It's about your function. Serve your wife. And, and I know it's like some men. Your wife works. She comes back. Then you ask for food. You ask for tea. And a woman has bought keto. She even bought sugar. And you are seated at home. And you call yourself a man. Foolish man. Those men are not here, so let's talk about them. Am I talking to people? So God says, stop complaining. Serve the, the woman. So, when she comes, hey, mommy, welcome. Have a seat, have a seat. Water or tea. You don't wait for an answer, my friend. You are a servant. <laughs> I went and brought the water. My wife said, I don't like water. I said, no, I will take it for you. Then I, your water is better than my water. My of course, and then I'm talking to her, how is your wife? Welcome, Welcome back. back. I am a servant. Of course, the cat is ready. Put in the flask she bought. You cannot do that if your mind is not transformed. Meanwhile, meanwhile, you also need to know this. I'm a mugisu circumcised. We don't do that nonsense. But if a man be in Christ Jesus, am I talking to people? I tell people I used to be a mugisu until I got born again. I'm now in heaven. Because 
as an ambassador of heaven, I'm supposed to operate according to what heaven says. I'm talking to people. You know, so, and then of course, the tea is ready. Have to have it. Then I remembered we had special play cups we use for serving special visitors. She's the, she's the one who bought where are you there? She's the one who bought them. Yes, and the people who are not the owners, we serve them in this place. When I picked them, then I found they had dust on them, so I had to wash them. Yes, Mama, I am coming. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. What are you doing? I'm coming. So, so normally me, I don't use trays. But I'm serving. So I looked for the tray. I put those things. Even serviettes. Then I came. Sure. I am still a man. Hello. Yeah, but with a transformed mind. So I got there. Ah, don't kneel, I said, my friend. Who tells you I'll always do this? Enjoy it, my friend. So I gave her. Then I sat. What about you? I enjoy when you take. I cannot take when you are not taking. <laughs> I made sure that I wash the other cup so she doesn't have to wash another one. So she brought for me on a tray. And now me, I was kneeling for a joke for her, she was really smart. You know, Uganda women. She served me. Oh, this is so nice. Don't mind. I'm wait for tomorrow. <laughs> Am I talking to people? And I'm still a man of God. Transferred mine. You know what happened? Do you know what happened? Do you know what happened? That woman, the next month, she got all her salary. She came, Mr. Mkabi, from today. As I get the money, I'll give it to you to look after your family. Hey. Of course, I had to act like a man. I say, oh, It's okay, baby, it's okay. Who knows what was happening inside? Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. It's okay. <laughs> of course, I told her from today. If I find you paying for hair. That's my responsibility. Every week, but Sunday, I give her pocket money. What is this for? For you. Use it on your things. And I have money. And sitting can see Hey, but where did it come from? Transfer I think I'm talking to people. I don't care how loud you shout. If your mind is not transformed. 
Waba ryo mutwe kwa hoka tatebeka nsibwe. You're wasting time. I said you are wasting time. But I thank God this transformation transformed. Nobody will remain the same. As a matter of fact, when you go back home, please do this. When you enter the house, say, before you enter, say, hey, Mr. Doa. The one who went is not the one who came back. I am new. Let's practice that. Let's practice. Stand up. We practice. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You have reached your door. You have opened it. Talk to your door. Mr. Doa. Uh -huh. The one who went is not the one who has come back. Tell your house from today you will see what you have never seen. Put your hands together for Jesus. Sit down. Come on, am I talking to people? Why are we struggling? You can have a very good principle. What do you call her? Principle. Staff. And you pass the papers. But if you don't transform your head, that certificate is useless. Make up your mind from today. How can I find a man, a whole man quarreling with your wife? No. And the children are hearing. Nonsense. Be transformed. You must tell yourself that you are born again. Why are we struggling? But the point is this for sure. Like many of us, we are children of God. But the way you pray, it's like, Lord, if you are able, I know, Lord, this is a lot of money. But Lord, I'm just asking, are you mad? Is like your presence says, I want to talk to you. The president says, I want to talk to you. Then they take you to state house. What can I do for you? Rechiba president. Your excellency. Katonde ya tonde guru nensi. Rohanga ya hanjirensi. Ega mafesa ne zabuzo na zange. Efesa na ne zabubi ona nebye. Ogendo sabebi ndu. Hati o jene no shaba. Nonsense. Tuwa rebi. Ezo no rusha. My house has uh, 15 self-contained rooms. E njuya anje. E inebi shenji. Kumi nabeta ano. Kando buriti shenji. Chine chigo. And I've not finished it. Kando tinka jiherzi. I want to make them 30. Ninyenda kubi hindura makumi ashatu. Why? Ahabwenji. My father. He own everything. So, and before I finish this, I'm going to first build one with 14 rooms. This one, I'm beginning it in January. I'm building a pyramid. I'll do the first one, which is my house. Then I will do one with 120 rooms. Why? Why? I have been. I serve a living God. Is power. Me impress our hunger. Oh, holy, the candle one man. Yeah, with the twenty-two young people in the church. Abantu pele na pele bato om church. We bought two and a half acres in the middle of town. To kuzere ekazi vene chweka hagati yeta wuni. With the buildings on. Kando to irohona nebe simbe. I was asking Mama, whose land is this? Nandioni imbuza nteri taka ne rioha. Ereiri. Sha. You have land like that and we are struggling here. No way. Yeah. Yes. We have to build a church when some people sit down and other people sit up. We take care of the third level. Penthouse, of course. I don't know if you have a penthouse. We cannot be here without a TV. 
Sha, your upper room and you have no upper TV. Abantu ba upper room tumine upper TV. TV, radio. TV, radio. Ah, huh? yes. University. Eno yata ndi zeta. Eji yata ndi chile. University. University. Where we have a special medical college which teaches people physical and spiritual healing. I told you that we need to show me how you must turn around to end the kabasha ho. I am serious. I am serious on these things. Yes. Na yo na zimba church masaka. Ngati kuli se de yamzu. Nuko mbeke kana sa masaka taro no shiyom zungu. We have built something. We are in 800 million. Then you come and give us 50 over 100. Then you say you are the one who built it. The the devil is a liar. Stand and no one has to be sure. I am serving God. If I am serving God, God should bring this car. Yeah. The one I am driving is a seventh car. Hati e yinu kufuga. You can say it's old, I don't care. It moves. Go in the Kujano parking, I went park in the Banga Yompia. You know, Wasaku is your parking, Horo, I him parking in Wawaja. First of all, we have a good motor game, Piaj, which is an absolute motor game. That's all money that runs in a hat and a watch and a carrier motor can send you when you know Kuru, Nibana, Tanja, the Kufuka. And, and who tells you that if I have an old car, I will not get a new car? Kano, Haro Kujana, and the motor can Kuru, the Nukasa Funansia. I think I'm talking to people. You are children of the Almighty God. Put that in your head. Take your and behave like one. Can't yet was in Kokumun to any Omana Kabaka Sangatango Yombanava copy. Hatomana Womkabin, Babasata Kusanga, no Yombanava and Tabatina Mugashu. No. Apana. One man came. I have my land in next to the high court, sir. The guy shifted the boundary. Hatom shisha ya hindra emiata no. So I said, ah. Namu jat. Hmm. Neighbor, chichi. Asamu rano nenge. Wano wa chama. Ahanto ha kachama. I said it passes where it's here. Ya nyatan haraban kahi. Ataha. You are right. It passes here. Namu jat apa na nyatan haraba. Me. Evi nyamu visa wan. Namu jat tati bi ne biom before dem biteke hanu. I have a land title. You cannot take my land. Hati nyine echa pachita katoka basa kurikiba. Bala babati yo msumbanga yomba ne neiba. Hatu barebe bata pasta mramba. Rumuna yomba na mramba. Kachiri kechapa. Kanduke haruwe chapa. Ah, ah. Unaonawe. Apana. As soon as I moved, they Hat, planted matoke. Hatu kuna arujireho basi mba hebe toche. In my land. Omuitakari anje. And God is good. Kanduru hanga numuru unji. The man got problems. Shisha kafunebisu. He decided to sell. They came to open boundaries. They took it back. Who has the matoke now? Hatai nebito chenoha. Kanye meren, I ate matoke. Ni ndiye bito cheva kavimbiara. I know who I am. Ni manya ni chechindi. Oba nyabe njogera na bo. Oba hi na ba nta bi nduku gamba na bo. One time I asked my, my wife, hey, Mama, have you seen my socks? Where did you put them? If I knew I put them, would I ask you? What nonsense is that? Are you remember what the man of God said. Hmm. This is my wife. No divorce. How can you be quarreling over strokings? Man of God, quarreling over socks. Stupid man. I don't even ask, oh baby, I'm so sorry. I'm 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 sorry. So why didn't you give me? I said, thank you. If I marry, I will marry you again. I put on and I left. Kabe na mukabu chire. Ne mama, oli musaje wa mukama no yombe la kusoksi kusoksi kusoksi. You are a man. No yombe shewa rohanga no tonga na rasa kusoksi. Temswaza njiri. Temswaza mukama vanang. Gama jamine yebaka. Talk to me somebody. Amen.
I went, I came back, she had bought 12 pairs. And I said, 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 I Pairs, my friend. Huh. Then that also brought a new problem. I throw them anywhere. One time I was in charge, I realized I'd put on brown and blue. <laughs> so my wife is very wise. She brought a. Aha. Uh -huh. Then sometimes I move, I throw the dirty one in the clean one. So she brought a basket. socks. Clean socks. My wife is a transformed woman. I think I'm talking to people. My wife gets money, she buys for the children things, and she says, Daddy bought. Daddy Daddy Hey, I'm the one who bought for you this. If I catch you, hey, and you call yourself born again. If I find you next time. One woman came and said, Pastor, I'm now a husband and my wife at home. When? She said, all the time. I said, ah, okay. So where are the male things? Yes, 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 what do you mean? Uh -uh. No, what makes you a man, Wama? Isn't it those things? Uh -uh. I mean, I'm the one doing everything at home. So, for me, when I come and I wash plates, am I a woman? And then you call yourself a Christian. Uh, ah. But in Nam, Nova and Nongo graduate in the Neva Sanga and Amyon Bewaka. Hati Yankatu was what I don't bring us up Sanga no Yon Beromoka. Not only are you saved, you have gone through our school. Hati Tujang was in the Kusuma Konka, Konkawa, Waswara, Nukuswara. In Teka Teka.